Hey, hey, hey! Armor Unit 01 here for Yu Yo dueling action over the internet, so let's go ahead and watch and cast a game! So we have Pro313 on the bottom playing Light Swarms, and we have I Am Dan the Man on top. Sorry, there I have some, some cupcake. And then it's Light Swarms as well. Raid in the Light Swarm arc is going to go ahead and activate its effect, which is going to go and toss two cards. Both of them were um, Light Swarm monsters. So. Raiden gains 200 attack points, and it's going to go ahead and attack onto Jane, which is 1800. And Raiden, and uh, I, uh, I am Dan the, I am Dan the man. I'm just going to call it Dan. He goes ahead and ends his turn, which is going to go ahead and toss two cards to the face down. We have Necro Gardener that was just sent, so that's going to be really useful for Dan. And Pro right now is going to go ahead and activate me, uh, Monster Reincarnation. A Necro Garment is always also sent to the graveyard. And Judgment Dragon is added to the hand. And uh, looks like Judgment Dragon, I was just reading the effect just to make sure that it's only your graveyard as long as you have four different uh, Judgment um, Light Swarm monsters you can switch with some. So no shared. And Charge of the Brigade is activated on Dan's side of the field. And that's going to go ahead and grab a Light Swarm monster to the hand. It's going to be Lila. And Wolf was uh, sent to the graveyard as well during that light charge. So Wolf is going to be summoned to the field. So this is a great opportunity for a Synchro to a level 4, I mean level 8, or a uh, overlay for rank 4. We do also have Lila in the hand right now, so that can be go ahead and summon up to the field, switch to defense mode, and go ahead and destroy it. But we're going to have Lumina, the Light Sworn Summoner, and that's going to go ahead and discard one card, which is Plague Spreader, and go ahead and switch to summon another Lumia onto the field in defense mode. Lumina is going to activate its effect, so another card from the hand is going to be sent, and it's another Necro Gardener, so this is definitely uh, going towards uh, Dan's. Uh, Favor. So Lila is going to be special summon onto the field, which is going to be activating its effect. It's going to go ahead and destroy this face down card, which is going to be Beckoning of Light. Discard all cards in your hand. You're going to add the same number of light monsters when you grab it to your hand. So Judgment Dragon and Jane is added to the hand. So, we have a Judgment Dragon at the moment, and we have um, only one, two. So we have two Light Storm monsters uh, right now. Trying to get out uh, this Judgment Dragon onto the field. We have two. So we have a Synchro Summon for uh, Michael Lightsworn of the Ark. Wolf is going to go ahead and attack into the face down monster, which is Eclipse Wyvern, so that's going to go ahead and send Judgment Dragon removed out of the field. And uh, Michael is going to go ahead and attack. Necro Garter's effect is going to be activated, and Lumina is going to attack as well, so negated on Michael's effect. So, all the effects are triggering off, and going to send a lot of uh, cards to the graveyard right now. We have Realm of Light. So this card, each time a card is sent from the deck to the graveyard, plays one shine counter on this card. All Lightsworn monsters gain 100 attack points for each shine, and the Jane of the Lightsworn is going to be summoned onto the field, and it's going to go and attack into this, uh, the summoner mark, the summoner, summoner, and Jane, uh, effect is going to go and trigger, which is going to discard a couple of monsters right now. And do we have four at the moment? It looks like we do. One, two, three, four. We have four Lightsworns on a uh, pro side of the field. Uh, definitely have four. For sure we have four over here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, yeah, six. Six light swarm monsters. Uh, but uh, this Realm of Light definitely um, uh, affects all monsters. So not only is uh, pro side of the field uh, changed as well to have uh, a power boost, but also on Dan. So we have an overlay for Love Chain, which is going to send a monster 
to the top of the deck, which is Judgment Dragon. And uh, that's a good setup play right there. I'm going to be Tribute Summon for a Celestial Light Spawn the Angel, which is going to go ahead and activate. And that's going to go ahead and sort up to two cards, which is going to be the Judgment of the Light and also the face down uh, the monster, which was Jane. Right now we have a 23 plus a 26 and an 1800, so right now that's a 49, uh, 67, so not enough to uh, kill off uh, Pro, but Pro only stands with 200 life points at the moment, and so right now he can summon on the Judgment Dragon onto the field, but he can activate the effect of Judgment Dragon. So, Judgment Dragon is a special summon into the field, goes ahead and battle into uh, Michael. Necro Gardener's effect is going to be activated, so it's going to negate the uh, damage right there. And Pro Surrenders. And so, uh, a little misplay here happening. Um, starting off with Lava, uh, I would say Lava Chain, and going ahead and put. Uh, Judgment Dragon on top on top of the deck, and then he, and then uh, Dan goes ahead and mill. Uh, Pro did mention that earlier, and uh, that was definitely a misplay. But uh, overall, um, it was really good that Dan didn't go into any Exceed monsters or any Excel, um, any other monsters um, during that last turn, or Synchro into something else, or yeah, do an Exceed summon of something else uh, while he had the full field right there. Because uh, the Judgment Dragon could have been uh, potentially just wiping out of the field and would have cleared out the field. Uh, so getting rid of the potential resources that you need back in the extra deck. So a uh, good play there, having the, all the monsters on the field. And uh, yeah, just overall good plays for the most part on uh, Dan's side of the field. And uh, I would say uh, it was just going in his favor. He definitely could have done a lot of things that he could have done. Uh, right now he has, I believe, uh, two gob uh, goblins up? No, what is it called? Um, uh, Plague Spreader Zombies. Is it two? He might have one. Uh, so that could have been another Synchro Summon right there. Uh, either for a level four that he had earlier uh, with so level six or anything else. But uh, yeah. Good decks, and uh, for the most part, good duels. Um, it wasn't just going; it wasn't just going pro's way. That's all. Um, but it did have uh, an impressive uh, mirror matchup right there. And as always, uh, don't forget your face down trap cards.